Hey folks, this is Vagrant. Welcome back to Viva Pinata Trouble in Paradise. Trouble in Paradiso. Anyways. <laughs> I feel like he's mocking me. <laughs> okay, buddy. You just you do you just keep up. That's fine. yeah, that's fine. So the plan today is to get ourselves a sars gorilla. We have literally three species left to go. One of them is a sars gorilla, and the other is... I, I want to call it sars gorilla. I don't want to say sars gorilla because then it just sounds like it's a diseased gorilla. Um, <clears throat> so we're looking for the sars gorilla, and hello, gorgeous. And to do that, we have to breed the Bon Boons and get a Bon Boon egg, and that's why the Cluckles is on the way as well. The garden is very boring these days. It is nighttime, I suppose. Did you just move, you weirdo? There we go, there's our Cluckles. Absolutely key to making this work. We're also going to work on a couple other things that I've got in mind. Place it in the garden. Oh, I'm barely gonna say. It's funny because I may never play this game ever again. It wouldn't surprise me, in a way. I'm only playing it because I've got this second channel. I really struggle to play games just for fun. Maybe if I have a kid one day, I think they'd really like this game, so maybe it'd be something I would play with them. Uh, right, so. <clears throat> in terms of getting the SARS Gorilla, which is the last normal pinata in the game, we have everything we need. There are two other pinatas we need, however, and they need. What the hell's a Heki? I think it was meant to say Geki. <laughs> we need a Dragonfly. We already have a Dragonfly. I'll get another one because I don't want to kill the one I've already got. If I was a Dragonfly, where would I be? So basically, uh, the Dragon Nash. It's Dragon Nash, not Dragon Age, by the way. I've just realised. Because it's meant to be Ganache. So it's Dr Ganache, Dragon Ash. It's not great, but it is what it is. What the hell is this? <laughs> Am I going crazy? There's a distinct possibility. What was that? You got <clears throat> um, both the dragon and the dinosaur require a decent amount of... Uh, tell you what, let's just work on the dragon, because what else am I going to do? I just have to wait for daytime for the bomboons anyway. Let's do that. Morning. Can I interest you in something seedy? Oh, no, I don't, don't mean like that. that. What was I saying? Oh, right, yeah, so... <laughs> yeah, I didn't actually remember what I was saying. I just thought if I went, oh, right, yeah, that, that would kind of like trigger my memory, you know? Didn't work. I'm just gonna buy a bunch of bananas. And there's one more thing we need. Which is over here. Oh, yes, so the dragon ash requires to eat several different pinatas in order to grow, grow full size. It doesn't just cocoon like the other pinatas, it has to eat pinatas to grow. There's So, I'm going to start stocking up on those pinatas. I'm going to get this in a triple just in case. Lovely golden pit, very nice. Bananas can just stay there for now. There's our peanut butter. I'm going to be hiding all that way in our little side shop area in a little bit. And what we need to do is nip over here, grab our egg, and we're going to put it over here. Shut up, phone. Now, <clears throat> the reason we do this, I've explained in the past, but I'll explain again, is because... And uh, let me just... Okay. Because um, the dragon, the colour that the dragon... Oh. Okay. Okay, I'm going to sell everything I don't need. And hope that will leave room for what I do need. And some peanut butter. All I need is the coconut macaroons and the peanut butter. And the amber. And the bones. I actually don't think I need the bones, weirdly enough. You'll see why in a bit. I'm going to keep them anyway, just in case. Okay, looking good. So we've got three blue bones, green bone, an amber, four macaroons. Yeah, cool. 
Oh, hopefully this'll work this time. Yes, yeah, we. Okay, Bon Boons, where are you, my friends? You need to make the hanky tonky tonky. It's the official term, by the way. You know what? No, wake up. Come on. Enough of that now. <laughs> You've had a nap. You don't get any more. It's time to make Le Bebe. Where's my cluckles at? So, yes, the Dragon Ash. <clears throat> no! What are you doing? It's the middle of the day. The Dragon Ash. Dragon Ash. That's what you should say. Dragon Ash. Come on. Make babies. Make babies. Thank you. The Dragon Ash will be born in a different colour depending on what surface you birth it on. Uh, how many do I need? Three? Bloody Nora. Run, Bon Boon, run! Oh, 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 oh. oh, I was about to go for that one, you know. At least this will never get more difficult. <laughs> We're not mass breeding them or anything, we're just trying to get an egg. Anyways, the Dragon Ash, the Dragon Ash will be a different colour depending on the land it's burned, birthed on. So it's either snow, sand, dirt, water, grass, or in the first Viva Pinata on cracked earth, which you can't get if you go to fold at the start. Beautiful. Look at that poking little bottom. Um, <clears throat> but because the cracked earth isn't in the game, isn't in uh, Viva Pinata Trouble in Paradise, instead what you want to do for the sixth colour is hatch it upon the golden paving. And if we direct our cluckles here over to the egg, as you can see, Cluckles all. Hopefully. There we go. Look at it! And it's golden! Because it has on the golden paving. I've never had a golden one before. I've literally never had one before. And this is not this is this is the baby dragon ash. <laughs> it's still fairly humongous. you'd better look. And now what we need to do to make it grow is feed it several things. Next up is a red hot. I'm actually going to stop doing this now because I need to go pick up the uh, the egg for the uh, the bomboon until the SARS gorilla turns up. That's important. That's kind of why we're doing this. So let me grab this, and then we just don't put the egg down <laughs> until the gorilla shows up, basically. So this might be a slightly dull. So cool in gold, I love it. I was gonna go for green because it's kind of classic, but I feel like I always get green. Does anyone remember or feel like going back to check? Because I certainly don't. <laughs> but what color dragon I got in my Viva Pinata playthrough on the Best in the Slot channel? I'd be very curious. I, I think it was green. <clears throat> Isn't that cool? I think it's randomized slightly as well, like in styling. Hey, level 100. Cool. Basically, I have to wait for a gorilla now. Not much I can do about it, really. But I can just talk about things, I suppose. Uh, but yeah, that's Dragon Ash. The Chocolodocus is actually even more convoluted. Now, both of them require feeding several things to grow up. But with the Chocolodocus, um, basically the first three bones you... I pick up. When you tinker a bone, it turns it into a body part, a skull, a spine or something, and a tail. I can't remember what the exact things are, but that's what they represent. Is that a flutter scotch? It just looks super weird. Um, <clears throat> look at the pecker mix on a little... Da -da 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 -da. Um... Where's this bloody gorilla, right? But uh, basically, the 
order that you tinker them. So the very first bone you tinker, always the head. The second bone you tinker, always the spine. The third bone, always the tail. So what you want to do is tinker the ones the right colour. So basically, if you tinker a red one, it'll be a triceratops head. If you tinker a blue one, it'll be a sauropod head. And then same again for the second bone and same again for the third bone. Um, I'm doing red, red, blue, I believe, which will make a blue triceratops. <clears throat> Had to be triceratops, really, didn't it? Oh no, one of them is the head, one of them is the tail, one of them is the colour. That's how it works. Where's this sauce gorilla? Funnily enough, I was on the wiki page for the sauce gorilla, just making sure I knew what I was doing, you know, that I had all the requirements. And, um... There was literally a post on there, or like a section on the wiki. I've been waiting for days and I can't find a sars gorilla. What's going on? And it basically said that, like the Elephanilla and like a couple others, I can't remember which one it mentioned, um, it just doesn't bloody show up and it's super rare, basically. And you have to be ready to get it, so... It really is going to be the entire focus of this video now. <laughs> Shut up, Chip. It's a nice opportunity to just kind of enjoy the garden, you know? The dragon is so cool! It's gonna be humongous! It's the same size as the Rory already and it's a baby. It's a baby. This might be the first time I consider cutting these videos just because... What am I gonna do? <laughs> what I'll do is play until I get the Sars Gorilla and I grow the dragon Nash up. If that happens to be longer, if that happens to take ages, then I'll cut it down. But I'm gonna say you're talking anyway, so you guys can just kind of deal with it. Hey, new chameleon. Ah, <laughs> I need to make sure I've got the requirements. Three monkey nut trees. Yeah. Twenty percent long grass. Yeah. Baby bamboo. Yeah. Four jars of peanut butter, six bananas, where are my bananas? Six bananas, four coconut macaroons. Hasn't turned up today, we'll have to wait till tomorrow. It's gonna be, it is gonna be one that takes a little while. Just, just through nature of being a rare specimen, basically. But, uh, yeah, three pinyards, like two pinyards left to go. We have a dragon nest. No, of course we have to grow it up, but it'd be silly not to, but... There are two species left in the entire game. Isn't that crazy? If Sars Gorilla turns up quick enough, this might be the final episode. I don't know yet. And then it's time for Halo! All seven Halo games in a row. As quickly as possible. It's not going to finish by the time Infinite comes out, but I'd like to finish by the new year. And then uh, I can play Infinite on the channel. I used to adore Halo. I used to be obsessed with Halo. I just haven't played it in ages, so I'm quite excited about it. I've got to say. I really want to put this down just for a second. I just want to go look at the Dragon Ash on the thing. I'm always like this. I get really... If I know I'm doing something to get a certain something, I can't help my paranoia. I always feel... What's Index do? Wait, no, this is Index. <laughs> um... I always just get really paranoid that it's not going to happen. It's kind of like if you think about like fishing in World of Warcraft, right? If you fish long enough in World of Warcraft, you'll fish up a turtle mount. It's adorable. But it, it can take hours, literal hours. And there's no indication that you're doing it correctly until you get the turtle. And in situations like that, I get super paranoid <laughs> that I'm doing it wrong. And that's why it hasn't turned up, you know? I'm pretty sure I'm good with the Sars Gorilla, but I still feel the need to check. Appear. Got a bomboon. Visit. Baby. Right, so visit is when it... Right, appear is when it comes around to the edge of the garden. Visit is when it walks in. I've got the long grass. I've got that. I will have the baby when it appears. Yeah, we're, we're fine. We are. We're fine. I'm just Maybe I'm just going to check... My, uh... 
I, uh, garden area. Yeah, that's, that's 20, right? Yeah, that's 20, that's over 30. We're fine! Just because it doesn't show up for one day doesn't mean anything. Okay. Oh, level 101. Cool. Keep the baby with us. And we wait. <clears throat> but yeah, I'm excited about Halo. I, I nearly bagged out a little earlier. If you're on the Discord, you'll have seen it. Um, I'm considering... I really want to play the new Guardians of the Galaxy. It's kind of... Oh, yeah, so cute. I love it. Look at how chubby it is. It's four arms. It's coin wings and big flappy tail and six legs. It's a very weird dragon, it must be said. Um, I suppose dragons come in all shapes and sizes and formations, really. What was I saying? Yeah, Guardians of the new Guardians of the Galaxy game is meant to be really good. It's getting really good reviews, but the goal with Halo is to play it as soon as possible to get it done before Infinite, or to get it done not too long after Infinite. So I can't really delay. So it has to be Halo next. It just does. But then I have to go and do bloody Evolution 2, and it's going to take up all my time, as I talked about in the last video, so... C'est la vie! C'est la vie, enchanté, mademoiselle. It's a bunch of really loud, sleeping pinatas. <laughs> what I'll do when the, um, Sarsgorilla shows up, and it's going to show up, cough, cough, is I'll move everything, I'll find out where it comes in the garden, and we'll move everything over there, basically. Until then, I don't know, observe the garden, I guess. Ah, it's here. I just, I just, I was, I was, ah. Okay, I'm good. Saw so squirrel, go. Cluckles. Cluckles! <laughs> I'm gonna put the egg down so it can hatch off its own. Oh, Cluckles! Cluckles, do you think? Baby, go, 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 go. <laughs> Time is off the essence. No, Sars Gorilla. Don't leave. Look, peanut butter. Bananas. Babies. Everything you love. Sars Gorilla, please. Look at this deliciousness I'm offering you. Seriously. Get it. You know he's thinking about it. He's observing my deliciousness. All crammed together in one delicious pile. Where's that baby? Where's that? Hello, baby. Come on, buddy. Come on. Please. Please. No, come on. Don't do this to me. Don't do this to me. Come on. Turn around. Come on. Yes? Yes! The baby's not gonna stay a baby. I'm gonna have to make another goddamn baby if you don't enter this goddamn god. Yes? Yes? Come on! <laughs> Come on! Oh, who's tempted? Who's tempted? You're tempted! Oh, who's a good gorilla? Who's a good gorilla? Right, there we go. Okay, I'm gonna ignore that now. I'm gonna let it do its thing. And we can get to work on our dragon ash. It should eat wait no, it's not it's not even the dragonfly first, it's something else. It needs milk. And it also needs a um, snapdragon flower. I think it has I I don't know if it has to be in order or not, but uh, I figure we'll do it in order just in case. No point taking the risk, right? So milk, the babies love milk. And a flower, snapdragon. Snapdragon, snapdragon. And we just ignore the gorilla and hope upon hope that it does what it needs to do. I'm not gonna ignore it, I'm gonna check it constantly. <laughs> but, you know, whatever. So that it is my thing, Costi, it is. You're my thing, Costi, I'm gonna miss you deeply. Another bloody, another bloody gorilla. Like buses, wait, is it the same gorilla? No, the gorilla's there. They're like bloody buses. You wait for one and then two show up. Well, I can't have the, I missed it, didn't I? Yeah. That's gonna be a pain. I can't have the second one come in because it's gonna eat 
the things I need to leave for this one. It's the Eglair problem all over again. I should have got more peanut butter and more mac- I actually might do that anyway. This might seem over the top, but I think it's a good idea. No, screw it. Oh, but then what if the other... How are we doing? Maybe I just have to trust that this guy will do it all in one. Let's chow down on a couple bananas. I think that's it, though. Three bananas. Not bad. I've, I've just got to have faith that he can do this. He's gone for the peanut butter. Or the macaroon. He's gone for the macaroon. No, he's gone for the peanut butter. Oh, he didn't come in anyway. It's just, it has to do it all in one go. Or, we'll have to make another baby. That's the way it is. That's two peanut butter down. Who's a hungry gorilla? I'm just nervous about the time of day. Like, I feel like when it gets darker, a lot of these pinatas leave. But look, it's... God, that was quick. He's an adult already. Jesus. I'm just selling it because it'll make the uh, the little game harder to play. Okay, what I'm gonna do? Are you going here for a drink? Where are you going? What are you doing? Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. What are you doing? Why? Oh! Ah! <sighs> right, we have to breathe the bombings again. I'm still open. Come in and take the weight of chocolate coins off. At least I don't have to rebuy the macaroons. It doesn't need the macaroons. He doesn't need the peanut butter in order to enter the garden, right? It's just for the residency. So we can um just use the we, all we need again is the baby. I don't need to worry about anything else essentially. Saying that, I might do it anyway, because again, I, what if the other gorilla comes in? Good evening. So I'm not the only person who can't afford this. I think that makes sense. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna keep make sure there's a stock. I'm not gonna go all the way to eight, but I'm gonna make sure there's always a stock of Don't forget four peanut butter, four macaroons, always in the garden. That's the idea. So I need three peanut butter, right? Are you sitting on one? You might be sitting on one. I also need a few more bananas. Lovely taking so Actually, only one, but still. And then we need to talk. What's Smash, by the way? This, this, my Dragon Ash Smash something. I feel like it might have done. Excuse me, buddy. Thank you. I think they should be fine to sit out there. I don't think that'll be a problem. Where is my dragon? It's a large golden dragon. It shouldn't be that hard to find. So if we click it, what does it say? Oh, nothing. How are you meant to figure this out? <laughs> out of curiosity. Uh, that's some milk for you anyway, buddy. <laughs> Lovely. Uh, Bomboons, are you both in there? Because I kind of need you to wake up and bang, if that's okay. I feel bad about this. I'm waking up Bomboons and dragon. I'm waking up everything. <laughs> but needs must, folks. Needs must. I need to have the baby ready, you know? Aren't you crazy kids? There we go. Lovely stuff. Bart's gonna get my peanut butter back. Got four of those, got four macaroons, got lots of bananas. Right, where are we? I'm really oh, oh that's not oh that's not a heart. <laughs> this looks, by the way, I, it's worth pointing out, this looks horrible. Like if I had to worry about this, this this may be like the uh the final one for Master Romance or something. I I think we might be in a spot above her. It's it's pretty horrible. I'm not really paying much attention, it must be said. I don't need to, but still. Maybe it'll give me like a bad baby. No, all babies are bad, what am I on about? Oh, ho, 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 ho. Babies are fine, I don't mind babies. Party boy! Right, okay, I kind of want to move... Uh, do I want to move out of here? I mean, he comes in, but he comes in... Uh, I'm going to move... Uh, hmm, I'm going to move a banana, just one banana over here, right? to lure him inside. And then one over here, right? It's like Hansel and Gretel. <laughs> I'm luring the gorilla to my house so I can eat him. Chip, I need you to move, buddy. 
Wait, why is he only doing... What? Ah, I did it again. I always do this. I always want to click A and then click on the gold or something separately. It's going to offer me. I'm going to say no. Any second now. Oh. Bart, come here. No. Bart, come back. I need to go pick up the baby. But I need Bart. Ah, what do I do? Okay, I think... Well, we don't need... It's fine. It's fine. I have to pick up the baby. Okay, and the wait for the Sarsgorilla begins once more. He's on the way. He's on the way. I see him bounding down the hilltop. Right, okay, I need to get some bananas, but I also need to get this on the... I just want to get into the... Right, sir. I'll do. Cluckles, do you think? I'm going to buy some bananas. Make babies, Cluckles. Make la babies. It doesn't matter. I can turn it all into profit. It's bananas. Sauce Gorilla Man. Just the baby requirement is nuts. It really is so difficult. Like, I know we're working around it with few problems to an extent. But it means you have to do this every single night, and it's not an easy to get pinata. But oh, that's okay. Come on. The baby won't be a baby forever. In your pup. In your pup. No. Wait, are you the right one? Can we check. Ah, uh, yes. Cool. Please come inside. Please come inside. Please come inside. Look, I'll get rid of the water. Is the baby still a baby? It's got to still be a baby, right? It's just been born. Yes, sir. You stay there, okay? You are baby for- Yes! It's in! It's in! <laughs> Glory! Glory is coming! How's our Snapdragon doing anyway? Ah, it's gonna take bloody ages. Okay, there's a banana. Okay, that's two bananas for my- Come on, Sasquatch. Come on, buddy. Pack a mix. Get out of the way. <laughs> I do love you, Pekka Mix. You're very cool. But get out of the way. You don't need a drink. You've only had a banana. You can drink when you're dead. Bananas are full of luscious liquid. Nice juicy banana. The juiciest of bananas. There we go. Mmm, juicy. Eh? <laughs> it literally goes and like, has a little cal- palo- Wait, are you eating a banana? Oh no, it's a- it's a macaroon- wait. No, oh, thank god for that. It's a long distance macaroon. I thought the peckin' mix had gone for it. Okay, that's all the bananas. One peanut butter, three macaroons, and we have achieved glory. Stop standing- <laughs> Chip! Stop standing on my piñatas! Cocoon hatch, that's fine. Shouldn't make a difference. As long as he doesn't leave. In which case we'll have to do it yet again. There's the peanut butter. Okay, no more peanut butters required. That's the last one. Right? Yeah, I'm gonna sell them, just so he doesn't eat them. They do seem to be intelligent enough to eat the correct foods. You know what I mean? Like, they always eat the one they need. But, it's just in case. Please don't leave. Please don't leave. You're walking a long way for that water. What if I build like a little pond here, right? This could be your drinking coal. There you go. You should get out of the way, please. I love you, but you're very much not the focus right now. Tuffly 15. Diamond doesn't you, son. Okay. Two to go! Two to go! <laughs> Don't walk away again, just eat it! Eat it! Eat it! Oh. 
Eat it. Yes. One to go. One to go. One to go. Please. I'm so close. Oh. Oh my god, if he left now, I would die. I would actually die. This way, the way is shut. Chameleon, get him! <laughs> Show me his boss. No, no, you were walking here. You, you were coming here. Why have you turned around? I have a horrible feeling about this right now. There's the guy's coming. I don't. Chicken, chicken, it's right there. Right, I don't want to look. I don't want to look. I'm going to listen out. I want to hear that breaking noise. Were you just bloody? Maybe it was in a bad position or something? Right, okay, again, not gonna look. Just wanna hear the noise. Come on, buddy, come on, buddy. Hooray! <laughs> I thought he'd walked away again. It's a bit weird, isn't he? Ooh, ooh. He looks so disappointed. He looks so angry. Oh, he's scared of the Wario as well. They're all scared of the Wario. I think Wario's gonna have to go, buddy. He's going all my pinatas. She snore really loudly. There we go, Sars Gorilla! Oh, this is gonna be the final episode. Oh, that's kind of sad. I didn't even realize. Thanks, buddy. Here you go, dragon. Can you eat this for me? And then it needs a dragonfly. Where's my dragonflies? When I was a young dragonfly, when he was a young dragonfly, it's probably sitting on something, isn't it? Realistically. Okay, well, since that's the- Oh, look how he sleeps! Oh, that's cool. Yeah. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. The dragonfly's around here somewhere, but... Okay, well, we can go back to Gretchen now. Ah, place it in the- And we also need a Salamango. And that'll be the last thing for our Dragon Ash. Probably further down. There it is. <laughs> Got there eventually. Okay, so. Chocolodocus. Chocolodocus. What we need, first of all, is a couple of bones. Because the blue bones and the green bones you dig up. But the red bones, if I remember correctly, you have to purchase. Yeah. And what we need is red, red. We'll come in here, get a blue, green. <laughs> we'll come in here, we get a blue. Okay, then we get Bart. And I think I believe Bart tinkers in the order that you click things. So if I click the one on the right first, that's the one he'll do first, I believe. So if we go like this, red red, blue, that should be correct. Let's see what happens. If I can find a dragonfly, I'll get moving. I don't know where the hell they- oh, okay. <laughs> I don't know where the hell they are. Oh, they're fine at night time. Oh, you glare in the banana tree. Who is making that adorable noise? Is that my worm? Who 
Star. Annoyingly, it might be my dragonfly, which just makes me feel guilty. Sounds like the worms. Come on, buddy. Look at him wobbling over. <laughs> oh, right, right. So we're looking for a skull here, hopefully. My, my. That item is too okay. Okay, whatever. I'm not going to worry too much about that. I'm sorry, dragonfly. Does he always do this? Is this always? I've never done. I've never done this before. Or if I have, I don't remember ever doing it because it was a long bloody time ago. Okay, let's assume that worked. In which case, it's time now for a red hot, red hot. Potties in your area now. This is very exciting. Oh, it's that, it's that. Okay, so let's go check out the mail. Wow, you're up earlier than most. School rib spider! Yay! School rib spider. Okay, I think that's right. I don't know what's going on. Okay. Yo, look at that! That doesn't look like a Triceratops to me. Have I done this wrong? Oh no, maybe. It's very cool. Alright, let's grab the next. Hey, the Red Hot's not dead. Why is the Red Hot not dead? Dragon, do you think? Come here. Okay, let's go check out the next. Have to do this bit by bit in England. Wow. Oh, maybe I don't. Ribs. These will be red as well. Hopefully. <laughs> ah, I need to do that. I'm a big dummy dummy head. <laughs> I've heard that line. I just don't want to open this soap every time. I just wanted it to be quicker. <laughs> I got lazy. Alright, back in one more time. And I believe what you have to do is leave the amber, anyways, and which we dug up ages ago, absolutely ages ago, from the mines and the digglings. And I believe what you have to do is leave the amber. Oh, postal woman, what are you doing? Except breaking my heart. Yo. Look at that! Gigantic. Okay, pack that away. It's just because we put the other one back in, so it's kind of done it in the other order, but that's fine. Wow, you're up earlier than most. And the red rips. Anyways, I believe what you do is you just put them all in. In here, along with the amber, which we dug up ourselves ages ago, and eventually, oh, what's that? <laughs> I thought it took a while, but it, it's literally instant. Okay, now, no, 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 we can't just hatch this instantly. We need to do. Okay, there's a lot going on here. Bear with me. Um, let's let's feed the dragon ash one because this is actually the last one for the dragon ash. Yeah. So we should see a cocoon after it eats this um, salamango. But the, dra the Chocoladocus is going to need stuff as well. It's going to need a Geki, first of all. So let's get that going. Could be further down, I reckon. Geki? Okay. Geki. What's that? Wow, it's super low. Okay. So you. Eat that. Okay. And we can't just hatch this willy-nilly. We actually need to do something else first. 
and that is going to paper pets and basically our cluckles needs a hat in order to hatch a dinosaur I think it's a hat really weird that it starts you halfway down is that it no I'm pretty sure it's a hat, but I don't know what it looks like. Oh, there it is. Jurassic hair. There you go. <laughs> Brilliant. Because it's Jurassic, right? <laughs> okay, so Cluckles has a new hat. And now we get Cluckles to come over here. And hopefully, that'll work. Cluckles, what are you doing? Come here. Little concerned that the Dragon Ash isn't doing anything. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, there we go! Yay! Awesome! Alright, so Dragon Ash is what are you doing, Cluckles? Why do you hate me? Come here. It looks really weird with the <laughs> the waddles still poking out the front. Wait for it. Hey, there we go. And that's the one I wanted as well. It's blue triceratops with like the fun tail. Look at it. Okay, it's a dinosaur. I've never had one before. I'm very excited. Literally never had one, I don't think. That's awesome. Right, so that's again, not fully grown. We need to do some work. First thing it needs is milk. Coins, if not for spending. I'd spend, I'd spend them here, here if I were you. Better, better value. value. We also need a bone, actually. We'll grab that as well. I don't know if it has to be in order, but I figure we'll keep it in order just in case. Very excited for a Thanks. big dragon. It's going to be big. Be <laughs> That's nuts. Okay, there we go. Well, where's my achievement for getting every pinata in the game? Because if I don't get an achievement for every pinata in the game... I will be paranoid until the end of the game that I'm missing something. <laughs> Look at him, he's humongous! What a beast. I'll go hang out with you in a minute, buddy. I've got a bone to feed. He's so cool! Giant golden dragon. Awesome. Oh, you're very sad. Why are you so sad? Your gardening is imp Maybe if I keep feeding him, he'll cheer up. It does seem to be. Maybe they're born quite unhappy and you have to feed them to... Maybe that's what we're trying to do. We're trying to get their happiness to full by feeding them stuff. Yeah, there's a Geki in it. Next up, we need... Actually, it's a Heki, according to how I've written it. Next up, we need a Coco Dial, so this is going to take a little while. Which is fine, it just means we get to spend some time with our piñatas. Now, Coco Dial's not nearly as high level as I keep thinking it is. Okay, it's got to be higher than this though, right? <laughs> I've missed it somewhere. There it is. It's mid-level. Got... Safely mid-level. Look at it! Oh, it's firing uh, like ammonites as well. That's pretty cool. What happens if I click on you? No, you don't tell me either. I think you're meant to figure this out by um, uh, talking to Lethos. Essentially. That's so cool! I'm gonna need a really good screenshot of you at the end, okay, buddy? And Dragon Ash as well. Massive. Happy. Having a good time. Big chonker. Do recommend you go and uh, you know Google it. You know check out what these some of the other designs look like if you're curious about that. I've seen the Dragon Ash quite a few times in my time. I'm very curious about the full size Chocolidocus. <laughs> However, it, again, that should be every single species in the game. You know what we have to do. You know the only way realistically to check is to count. It's just it's just the way it is. It's just the way it is. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six per page, okay? Six, 12, 
that's going to be really annoying. 23? Yeah. 29, 35, 40, 39, yeah, 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 um, 45, 45 up to 51, so it's 49 again, 49, 54, 60, 69, <laughs> uh, 74, 80, 85, 91, 90, I should say, 96, that's the end. Okay. I, I thought there was over 100 species. This is making me concerned. I may have miscounted. Maybe it's 100, over 100 species, including sours. It could well be. How many species trouble in paradise? I said 96, right? Don't tell me more than 100. That's not helpful. <laughs> That's super not helpful. I can't th Okay, we're gonna go through the list, alright? And make sure we've got them all. We're just gonna go one by one. A rock nid, yes. Badgical, bark bark, bispotty, couple of flutter scotches, bonboon, flutter scotch, bunny comb, buzzinge, buzzle gum, camello, candari, cherupin, tuna corn, chippopotamus, chocolodocus, choc stritch, cinnamonkey, cluckles, cocodile, crowler, crustacean, donut, dragon ash, dragonfly, eglare, elephantilla, fizzly bear, flapyak, flutter scotch, Foreheads, Fudge Hog, Galagoo, Geki, Goobar, Flutter Scotch, Hoggart, Hooty Fruity, Hostachio, Jamelian, Jelly, Juicy Goose, Kitty Floss, Lacquer Toad, Lemoning, Licker Toad, Limoceros, Macaraca, Rune, Mallow Wolf, Muju, Moosipan, Moth Drop, Mouse Mallow, Nootgut, Parmadillo, Paribo, Pecker Mix, Pengum, Piana, Pixie, Flutter Scotch, Pololi Bear, Pinocchi, Pretz Tail, Profitamol, Pudgeon, Flutter Scotch, <laughs> Quackberry, Raisant, Raspberry, Flutter Scotch, Red Hot, Rorio, Robin, Smorpion, Salamango, Sars Gorilla, Shelly Bean, Sherbat, Smelba, a bunch of sours at the bottom, Sparrowmint, Squazzle, Swanana, Sweetle, Sweet Tooth, Syrupant, Taffley, Tartridge, Tigamus. Did we ever get Tartridge? Yeah. Tigamasu, Twinger Snap, Fulchuro, Walrus, Worm, Flutter Scotch, Flutter Scotch, Zumbug. Okay, there's nothing there that I didn't recognise. I don't know if that's enough to say that we definitely... I mean, I just expected something to pop up, you know? But I guess maybe it just doesn't happen. I think we've got them all. I, I'm prepared to say we've got them all. If <laughs> one of you at home can think of one that we don't have, feel free to let me know. Oh, it needs a Jameleon for the last one. Sweet. I'm sorry, Coco. You were born to die. What can I say? It's a very aggressive Triceratops. It's a carnivorous Triceratops. Like all the best Triceratopses are. You done already? Not done yet, buddy boy, I'm afraid. I want to make sure it actually ate the sweet. I think it did. I'll clear a path out of the way. It's on his way. On his way. It still says being hunted. In theory, it's still happening. It's just taking a while. <laughs> I gave up. Let's try that again. I think we're in business. Oh. 
Yeah, if any of you can think of a species we've not had, if anything on that list rang a bell or something, feel free to let me know in the... Uh... No, you have to eat it, buddy. It doesn't count if you don't eat it. Just go to sleep. Right, which one's the which one's the right sweet? Oh, it's gonna take so long to Oh my god, this is such a disaster. They all look the same! I'm not convinced they ate the cocoa dial either, right? I'm gonna feed it another bloody cocoa dial. It clearly just wants us some sleep, so I'm just gonna let it get some sleep and then we'll do it again. You look confused. That means what do you want me to catch? Wanna place bets? I swear she's got like tons of new lines. Like two lines I've heard this video that I've never heard before. I just want you to be big and strong, okay? It's a shame there's no way to get all of the pinatas in like one thing, like all the different variants, for example. What you'd have to do is basically just go to another garden. But you can't trade Chocolate Duck because you can't trade Dragon Ash. The one that you get is the one that you get. It's like tied to your garden, basically. How you doing, buddy? I'm gonna miss this game. It's been nice just to play something good and wholesome, you know? And uh, I know playing Halo, which isn't exactly <laughs> indicative of that, that I'm gonna miss it and that I wanna keep playing stuff like this, but um, it is just because I re I've wanted to do this Halo playthrough for about five years on the channels. I even tried it on the Best of Thought channel once and just didn't really take off and had copyright problems because I got early access to MCC before it even came out back then. Um, and it fixed a lot of the problems I had with it on PC as well, which is another reason I want to do it. But, um, but, um, then we're going to play Slime Rancher <laughs> or Guardians of the Galaxy, but probably Slime Rancher and something can replace Far Cry. Thanks, Slime Rancher. <laughs> Uh, I also want to play Darkest Dungeon 2. Very excited about that. I actually have about 30 games. Actually, if you count all the Assassin's Creed's as one game, all the Resident Evil's as one game, and all the Halo's as one game, then there's 28 games now. Oh, it did work! Bloody no- Oh my god, it's gonna be huge! <laughs> it's gonna be massive! What? Yeah, there's 28 games on my Vagrant 2 playlist. Those are games that I've seen that I want to play that I think would be fun for the channel. And, uh, yeah, it's a fairly ginormous list. Yo! <laughs> this is huge! What? That's madness. Absolute madness. I can't wait for this to pop out. Hey, Sherbat, you're a weird inclusion. Why are you here? <laughs> Out of curiosity. Oh, it's here because of the, um... Because of the Hootie Fruity, I think. There isn't a ton of stuff in the garden, but it's it's a nice garden. Well, it's got some it's got some, it's got good the garden itself kinda sucks. But it's got good pinata life to it, you know? There's a lot of varied species. Clara and Chip are still here. And it's got a big ass dinosaur. <laughs> oh, very cool. I need to go into photo mode. Which is never a good thing. As we've seen in the back. Oh, you've gone to sleep straight away. Damn it, I was hoping to catch it when it opened its eyes. I'm inside you. You're inside me. No, rubbish! It takes so long! Oh, that's kind of cute, but no. No, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, maybe that'll do, actually. It's just, it's just that I have to hide the cursor, you know? Yeah, I'm sure one of those is good enough. It helps that it's massive, because it's easier to hide. I just want it in good light for the thumbnail. It's so cute! I love it. It's gigantic as well. It really is absolutely massive. Bigger than Chip. It's maybe 
It's bigger than the elephant illum as well. It must be close. Oh. You know what? It was really cool seeing it like that, but that means it's the end. We're done. We've done everything. I don't know what else to tell you, folks. That is it. It's it's done. It's just done. It's been a hell of a journey. It's been a lot of fun. I've really, really enjoyed this playthrough. I've had a really good time. It took a little longer than I would have planned because I know I kept taking some breaks and stuff, but I've had a, I've really enjoyed it. I hope you guys have too. I think you guys have responded really well to this playthrough and people have clearly got into it and enjoyed it and it's been super cute and hopefully worth uh, following along with. And <laughs> I don't know how people will feel about Halo, but Halo is very much a personal thing for me that I feel that I have to do and, and do want to do as well, it must be said. Okay, recording this the next day and kind of slipping this into the video, I'm going to mention many, many times throughout this video that uh, it seems like I've got every single species and it turns out I didn't. Someone commented in the last video and I only just saw it that apparently I didn't get the pink flutterscotch. It does ring a vague bell, the pink flutterscotch would have... Uh, well, it flew away, it got scared away, it didn't eat the, the water lily necessary to make the pink flutterscotch. And later on I'll go through the list of all the pinatas I need, or all the pinatas I have to make sure I've got them all. But, you know, the flutterscotches, I kind of didn't pay that much attention. And it really, if I was going to be missing a pinata, it was always likely to be a flutterscotch. Um, I'm going to have to put this video quite late in the video, otherwise you guys are getting massive spoilers. So, so it's going to be later than I expected. So I'm just waiting for this water lily to... Uh, to finish growing. I find it really interesting just actually watching it, oddly enough. You can see this little stem growing up here from the side of the lily pad at the moment. And I've just watched it, the entire thing, grow bit by bit. There's nothing else I need to do, so thought, why not? We've got a flutter scotch ready to go in my delivery section, although I believe there's a couple in the garden already. Yeah, there's, there's actually two of them over here. I'm just going to send you over here, buddy, in preparation, because this should be nearly done. Just need this to go poof. Poof! It's not doing it yet, though. Poof! Just hang keep hanging around here, buddy, if you don't mind. We're nearly there. We're nearly there. I don't know if something will happen, given that this is the final species, but we'll uh, see very soon. What are you doing? Oh, you're, you're a dragon. What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh! Oh! It popped! It went poof! Okay, so, let's try this then. Whether that YouTube commenter was correct or not, we'll find out in just a second when it says whether we got a new species. Let's find out. And if so, that means I would have, if I hadn't seen that comment, I would have finished this entire series without ever actually gathering every species, which would have been immensely disappointing, so... I'm going to appreciate it immensely. You haven't eaten that, have you? Come here. There you go, buddy. Okay, let's have a little wait and see. Okay. Hooray! <laughs> you were right. I was missing the pink flutterscotch. Good shout. Tell you what. I mean, we still don't get anything. I was really hoping for, like, a, a pop-up or something saying, you've collected every species, you know, let me know, please. We're just going to double-check that we got all the flutter scotches. I believe we did, but the, it shouldn't be hard to find out because there's ten of them in total. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight... Nine, ten. Okay, we have every flutter scotch. I believe that we have every species. Enjoy the rest of the video. It's hard to, it's it's weird because it's not like right. We played Mass Effect on the channel, <clears throat> and we got to the end, and we we did, we did all three games in succession. It was a multi-month operation, like half a year or something. It took absolutely ages. We got really attached to all the characters. I still have my um. Is he in here, actually? No, it's in my bedroom. I've still got my Morden Solar singing doll. <laughs> if you haven't seen it, it's on my Twitter from a while ago. Um, and he sings there. Um, 
the Solarian so Scientist song. It's amazing. But when that ended, I was sad because it meant I wasn't going to spend any more time in that world. As it happens, we may end up playing Mass Effect again because the trilogy thing is now the Legendary Editions on uh, Steam, but probably not for a long time. I like how he seems to get on with everyone, you know? And he's got a beak. Head of its time, this game, I tell you. Head of its time. He <laughs> like, just looks so happy. I'm glad they added it. It's a very cool addition. I wonder what they'd add on the third game. Because the dragon was in the first game. The, the dinosaur wasn't. It's got four eyes. It really is a very weird creature. Sorry, buddy. <laughs> don't, don't, don't get mad. And uh, this is different because this is not a story. I'm not involved with the characters. I'm not really that involved with any of the pinatas because most of them haven't been here for long. Other than Chip and Clara and uh, Wally in particular. Wally's been here for a bloody age. Is Wally still here? Are you Wally? Willow. I'm a little worried that I keep seeing Willow but I don't see Wally. Willow's been here for quite a while anyway. Well, she's not an OG like Wally and Wanda. I need to check. <laughs> Wally! This should be where we finish things off, you know, with Wally. Been with us for a very, very long time. An incredibly long time. Hello, buddy. Wally and Willow. His second wife. <laughs> yeah, right. Well, ladies and gentlemen, with that, that is the end of Viva Pinata Trouble in Paradise. Thank you so much for enjoying it. Thank you so much for joining me throughout this entire playthrough. Um, I'm happy with this as a finishing point. I think going back and getting Mass Romancer for everything would feel anticlimactic in a sense. And uh, I don't think it would be that fun either. It would feel even more regimented and sort of doing the numbers than uh, what we've been doing so far. I think this is a nice place to render, and there's other games I want to play anyway. So, Halo, hopefully, is the plan to start this week. Um, we're going to start with Halo Reach and go through the entire thing. They fixed a lot of the issues I had. Um, those of you who have better memories than myself will <laughs> remember that we did play Halo Reach on this channel in the past, but uh, there were some problems. They've all been sorted, hopefully, and uh, I'd love to play through that entire MCC, and that's the plan, along with Far Cry 6, and then we'll play Slime Rancher, I promise, because I really want that. I've already got it installed, ready to go, so um, I suspect that will replace Far Cry 6. We'll see what else comes out in the meantime, but that's that's the general idea right now. It's hard to say goodbye. <laughs> I may never play this game again. That's really upsetting in a way. <laughs> been a big part of my life in a weird way. The first game more than the second, it must be said. But still. Right. Thank you very much for joining me. I will see you lovely folks next time. Cheers much of us always. Bye-bye.